with my Titan just bouncing off walls, dude, I swear to God, I feel like I'm in a bumper car. Let's do this now. Got transcend it. Please come to me. My God, bro. Why do these guys hide? seconds. So, so I think I figured this out. I think as long as you stay in, in this little lighted area, uh, these ads won't push you in. I, I could be right. I could, I could be wrong. Maybe. But I notice every time when I come here, the ads never push. But the minute I go into like a, a like a dark uh, area, uh, they they want to push. Sometimes, uh, sometimes it's a nice uh, push you. It's, it's just so hard to move around. Okay. See, I, see, I, I noticed none of the thrall uh, come in here. Okay, so I got ship. I 
I think that's what it is. You gotta stay in it in a, like 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 a lighted area. Okay, I need I need to get my buff. Now I need to come back here to this lighted area. I I think I got this clown figured out. See, look at that. Every time I go go into this lighted area, they never come in. I think I'm onto something. Knights are dead. I I still have to get get my buff. So I'm looking for two symbols. The ship and the ghost. Voila. There we go. The ship and the ghost. So now, now I need to uh, leave this room. Come through the portal. Voila. So now you come out here, you look for the ship and the ghost. You're going to see these uh, pervading markers. Each one of them is going to re uh, resemble uh, a certain symbol. So we're looking for a ship and a ghost. Okay, that's a witness. Got to make sure the ogre doesn't see you. Okay, I got the... I got the ship. I need to come up here. I gotta be careful that I don't touch the other one. Come over here. I got plenty of time. Okay, that's the witness. We don't need the witness. We're looking for the ghost. Come right down here. Now, we're ready for uh, DPS. Wait for all the ads to come in. Boom. Not bad, not bad. Okay. So the trick on handling this guy, basically, like what I said, guys. Um, don't use your regular super. Step inside the buff. When you grab the buff, pick up the shield. To work the shield, all you have to do is do your two uh, uh, super buttons. And then once you do that, it's going to drop a shield. After that, uh, you just go ham on him. Don't use your regular super. Pop your prismatic super first. Once he's debuffed, then go ham on with your other super. Okay, so now we're just gonna step in. A gift from the traveler. We're gonna it's grab this. To we're gonna charge up our relic. We're just gonna chill right here. We're gonna wait for the big boy to come in. Once he comes in, we're gonna step inside the buff. Okay. Okay, he's debuffed. Okay, 
And what you want to do is clear out the clear out the ads first. His shield's still broken, so. A bad, huh, guys? So, like I said, do that, and you'll be golden. Prismatic, grab the buff, grab the shield, pop your super with the shield. Uh, once you're inside the buff, uh, you, you don't have to stay inside the acorn, uh, inside the preventing darkness. So just grab the buff, pop your prismatic super. Once you debuff them, then pop your other super. And that's where all the damage is. So now we're just going to play uh, cleanup. We're going to make sure all these ads are, are dead. Once uh, all the ads are dead, we're going to make sure our uh, prismatic is charged. We're going to pop our super. We're just going to come in and out. Come in and out. Drop the grenade. Wait for my grenade to charge again. Okay, that should jolt to everything and kill everything. Okay, now we're just gonna come in here and we're gonna drop this uh, little blight. We're gonna come to the other side, guys. We're gonna do the same thing. Okay. We're just gonna drop in, throw the grenade, and get out. As long as you throw your grenade uh, at the ad, it's gonna jolt everything, and it's gonna kill everything. So now I can just come in here. We're gonna come down here, and we're just gonna grab our uh, light and darkness ability. Okay, we're gonna do the same thing. The only difference is I'm gonna wait till I get my super. So we're just gonna wait till I get my super. Calling all guardians. Calling all guardians. Yeah, so we're just gonna wait till uh, I get my super. So. Goodbye. 
Such a good boy. It's good, huh, son? Daddy loves you. I love you. You love me. I love buddy until the end of time. That didn't make no sense. Give the dog a bone. Buddy is freaking going home. Ah, he is home. That did not make sense. But, does it have to make sense? You know? As long as you're having a good time on life, that's all that matters. Shake and bake, baby cakes. Shake and bake. Uh, popcorn? Popcorn? Oh, popcorn? <laughs> Alright! Let's do this. I gotta hurry up and get all this, uh, dark area. Man, dude, I, I need clothes to drapes, dude. I literally you can't see. Hurry, J Mob, hurry! I got 20 seconds. So I think what I'll do is I'll, I'll just uh, stay right next to this buff right here. Okay, so we got triangle. Keith, are you watching? Yeah, one thing I noticed about this, guys, that if you stay right here, they, they, they really don't really uh, push you at all. So as long as we keep grabbing this buff and coming back to this uh, spot, I I think we're good. I might have to push up a little bit forward, that way I could see uh, what's around me. Okay, I got plenty of time. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna come back in here, grab my buff, and then come back over here.
All right, good deal, good deal. Okay, so both knights are dead. This is great news, guys. This is fantastic news. So now all I have to do is uh, clear out these ads. Always make sure I always set that uh, 44 second buff. So I'm just going to come back in here uh, just in case. Yeah, that's what it is. Uh, I, I finally figured this out. If you go into the darkness, they will attack you. But if you stay into the light, they won't come to you at all. The knights might come to you, but it's rare. But as long as you stay in this little lighted area, they won't attack you. So now we're just going to go grab the buff. And we got uh, 44 seconds, I believe. To find out uh, where uh, the rest of these ads are, we already know what the symbols are. So, and we're only gonna grab the buff if if we have to. Okay, so I got 20 seconds on my buff. Perfect. Okay. So I I notice every time I hit the the acorn, uh, that I get a 44 second uh shielded uh from the darkness, which is good. So now I'm just gonna take my time and go slowly up here and just listen uh for ads. I think that's the last of the ads. So now what we could do is we could look at our symbols before we leave. So we got triangle and we got the witness, okay? Memorize that. Triangle and witness. So we're gonna come back over here, guys. We're gonna vacate since there's no more ads. And we're just gonna enter the portal. Not bad. That was very good. Okay, so what did I say? Triangle and the witness? Okay, so we got the witness. I'm guessing triangle is going to be right there. Okay, so we got the witness. And it really does not matter what order you pick it up. Okay. We're going to hit these guys with the shotgun grenade. Now we're, what we're gonna do is we're gonna play the, this uh, this little corner right here. We're gonna wait for the ads to push. Very good. So before you even start your DPS phase, guys, um. You want to make sure all the ads are done. History. Finito. Okay. Before you even do DPS, check for ammo. Make sure your weapon's reloaded. Make sure you have your prismatic. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to step right in into this uh, little debuff right here. For the shield of the, uh, darkness. We're going to shoot the acorn. I call it acorn. I don't know why. You guys can call it whatever. We're going to step in there. Shoot the acorn. After that, we're going to pick up our, uh, our relic. And we're going to let it build a full charge 
Uh, that way we could pop off our super if you guys don't know how to do it. It's going to be your L and R1 buttons on your, uh, on your controller. Okay? After that, we're going to drop a shield. We're going to stay inside the buff. We're going to pop our prismatic first. After we uh, pop him with a pr uh, prismatic, basically what we're going to do is we're going to go ham on him with our super. We're not going to use no weapons because we don't really need to. I mean, he could, but, you know, I, I just feel like this is stronger. Okay. So, uh, so basically what we're going to do is, uh, if, if we want to make this even stronger, what I could do is I could, uh, put on synthoseps, right? And any time I, I get, like, uh, surrounded, basically what it's going to do is it's going to uh, create a buff on my melee attack, and it's, I'm going to be able to shred him, uh, even stronger. Uh, I don't know why I didn't do it earlier, but... I am now, sucker. All right. So basically, what we're gonna do, like I said, guys, make sure your weapons are reloaded. Okay. We're gonna step into this buff right here. We're gonna shoot this little buff. Okay. We got 43 seconds worth of damage. Okay. So basically, what we could do is uh, we could wait till we charge everything. Okay. We could. We could drop this right here. Come back over here. Okay. We're gonna hit him. Oh. Actually, you don't even need prismatic. Holy cow. Look at that guy. Look at that guy's flawless victory. You don't even need prismatic. Just sent those steps. Let's freaking go, baby cakes. Flawless victory. Let's freaking go. Flawless, guys. Flawless. That was flawless. Let's freaking go. 